हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम और वेलकम बैक टू डी कप टारो माय नेम इज रेया एंड इन टुडेस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू बी टेकिंग अ लुक एट व्हाट मैसेजेस यू नीड टू रिसीव फॉर द अपकमिंग 10 डेज एंड ऑफ कोर्स एज ऑलवेज यू हैव थ्री पाइल्स इन फ्रंट ऑफ यू सो प्लीज मेक श्योर व्हेन इट कम्स टू पिकिंग अ पाइल यू पिक वन दैट इज मोस्ट फॉर यू अकॉर्डिंग टू द फेदर्स द इमेजेस एंड इफ नॉट अकॉर्डिंग टू वन ऑफ दीस प्लेट्स I will give you some time when it comes to selection and then we start with pile 1. Hello and if you selected pile 1 this is what you can expect for yourself in the upcoming 10 days and of course as always we start with monology. Now the first message for you is nothing is yet set in stone. So now you can still influence the outcome of particular situation. You can do things right, you can make more effort and things will be as per your liking. So you still have time to make a difference in whatever it is that you are working on. From your tarot, you have 7 of swords, 8 of wands, 7 of cups, page of cups and you have the seven of wands all right uh, first of all let me just tell you this the week ahead is going to be very busy for you there is a lot happening lot of movement happening and a lot requires your attention and i get a feeling like you'll constantly have to be on your toes yeah remember this but there is a big choice coming in front of you which way to go what to do and what is the right thing for you to do at this point of time and please make sure when it comes to your decision making, you take time and do something that is for you a logical fit and an emotional fit too. Yeah, please consult both parts of you because that decision is going to be very important and it influences your life a great deal. In the upcoming 10 days, you're also going to be giving a lot of attention to your hobbies because you're particularly sensitive about certain things. Maybe your energy level is going to be a little low sometimes and you feel like doing something good for yourself and you're just doing that. You're doing something that feels naturally right for you at this point of time. You may also spend a lot of time with friends, with family to just, you know, hang out, to chill, to relax. That relaxing element is very much present for you in the upcoming 10 days. So it's going to be a busy time, but you also have a little bit of time off. One thing I'll tell you, in the upcoming week, you are likely to take certain shortcuts that if you want to do something, you're like, okay, maybe nobody is noticing, so I'll do this. Please avoid that. So if you're particularly studying for something, study it well. If you're submitting a project, please check it and double check it. Okay, don't leave things halfway. Don't leave it for luck because, you know, it's, um, it's better to be careful of sometimes. Now, in the upcoming week, the possibility also is that you may have a difference of opinion with somebody. You have a particular opinion, but somebody is like, you know, maybe you're not right. And that sort of offends you a little bit is what is coming forth. So please make sure if you feel a particular thing is right by you, you do it for yourself. Now, one thing that is really standing out for me is somebody is keeping a secret from you. Somebody is sort of being shady, you know, they're not revealing the entire picture to you or they're sort of being dishonest with you. So in the upcoming week, please make sure you don't take people at face value to double check things on your end and just do things that are right by you. Yeah, be careful of people being two faced with you in the upcoming week. Now, you also need to make extra effort towards something. So if there is a particular goal that you have in mind, you have to be dedicated and I mean dedicated every single day. Don't be like, you know, oh, I'm going to work at it for two days and leave it and come back later. No, if something needs to be done, it has to be done properly and it has to be done every single day. So dedicated effort is going to be important in the upcoming week. Now, along with that, self-discipline is something that is going to be very important. So please make sure if you can, you have a routine around yourself. One, because you're going to be very busy and then it may so happen, you know, your energies get shattered and you don't know what to do when. So then self-discipline from the beginning will help you manage your time and energy effectively in the upcoming week. Now, 
in the upcoming week it is also important that you clean your space okay so once again arrange your books properly arrange your closet properly make sure that every area of your house is dusted properly because remember when things are not dusted or if your space is not clean your mind will be cluttered and a cluttered mind doesn't help anybody so please clean your space in the upcoming week and also you need a little bit of reflection on your part you have to ask yourself some very important questions and i get a feeling like this is associated with a choice that you have to make once again as i mentioned don't make impulsive decisions reflect and if a certain thing feels right for you do it and of course sometimes this could also mean you know taking some time out taking a holiday going out with friends coming back and then being like you know okay i'll address this now but reflection on things are very important because what will happen you know it's the reflection that will get you clarity and then without a doubt you will know that okay this is the right thing for me i'm going to do this and you know you'll be very clear especially about the choice that you're supposed to be making in the upcoming 10 days now i'm also going to shuffle on camera for messages about your relationship let's see look deep within and you will feel my love my love for you is as deep as the ocean now clearly somebody loves you loves you like really really deeply and you don't have to ask them whether they love you or not you will know it intrinsically and that is the nature of love you know we always know when somebody loves us and you know i feel like that is something that is true for you so you can feel somebody's love if you could do anything what would it be the answer dwells in your heart not in your mind for the heart is the gateway to your soul so when it comes to matters of heart when it comes to relationship don't use your mind that much because at this point of time for relationship every heart centered decision will actually be right for you and one more let there be closeness between you but always give each other space love never claims it simply allows and gives so once again when it comes to your romantic relationships don't try to be with the person you love all the time let them miss you you know sometimes it's great to give you space because you know then maybe the other person realizes that okay you are very important to them and they'll come back to you but regardless space in a relationship is important and it is especially highlighted for you in the upcoming 10 days and healing now especially if there is some kind of misunderstanding between you and a partner uh, imagine that your relationship is being healed that your relationship is you know surrounded by this healing light of energy and things are getting better and especially if you guys have a fight in the upcoming 10 days please make sure to give each other space because sometimes in space as well healing naturally happens yeah i will also now give you messages from your tea leaf cards to see what extra messages you need to receive all right you have or uh, someone is behaving stupidly and i get a feeling somebody is behaving stupidly in a relationship because of which you have certain misunderstandings and then healing is required okay so i feel like that's going to be with that uh protection from a powerful friend remember spiritually and otherwise you're protected so basically there's nothing really for you to worry about because if you're protected you are protected a uh, happiness okay there's going to be time for you to be happy this week you know i feel like it's going to be either with friends or family when you're hanging out with them but happiness is definitely on the cards for you uh you have work achievement and success so once again when it comes to the work that you're doing if you do it properly without taking any shortcuts you will find the achievement and the success that you're looking for and if you can hear the faint sound in the background is actually furniture ha work happening so please ignore that uh and karma okay you will reap what you've sown so once again you know if you've done good you're going to be receiving good and if you've done karma that is not right you will get that back too okay because karma is in place and karma never misses us and because you know few it's like you protected and there's happiness as well so for you guys i feel like this may be good karma or even if it is certain negative karma you will be protected from it maybe by the grace of a guru or by the grace of an ascended master and uh excitement so something is happening that is going to be making you very happy and very excited as well uh peace and harmony okay so you're going to be having time where you're going to be peaceful 
okay probably when you're pursuing your hobbies or you're just taking that little bit of a time out but there's going to be time where you can just unwind and relax for yourself or uh, something important such as a new job or a race so once again if you want to make a choice regarding you know whether to stick to your current situation or move to a new job i feel like that is an important decision that you have to take uh, let me tell you this if you're looking for a new job go for one which is offering you a raise you know because that's it's highlighted and honor and respect will come to you so in the upcoming week something that you're doing is getting you the honor and respect that you deserve yeah i am now going to be giving you your letters and numbers that are important for the upcoming week okay you have t u 24 o 31 29 s a uh, is somebody appearing for an examination sat is good luck if you are b 11 e r n you have nest so i think you know dealing about a home situation or you know thinking about moving to a new place or a flat that may be indicated for you as well you have t you have m you have e number one number 20 a i you have g yeah uh, once again you have psi okay so grace of a good oh wow look at this so if you believe sai is your guru then clearly he is and on which note i feel like for your pile i will give you messages from baba i was not going to be including it in the video but well <laughs> you guys are special clearly i'm gonna put this here all right let's see what baba has to tell you a solution okay so if there is a particular problem that you guys are facing remember solution is at hand and you have nothing to worry about uh your mind has tremendous power surrender it to baba and let him direct it so once again because sai is your guru and once again you had the card of protection remember protection powerful friend so you'll be protected especially when baba is making the decisions for you obviously you're going to be protected so don't worry about that okay i'm going to give you these because these really want to come out or uh, do not doubt once again please have faith have faith in baba yeah i feel like after this you better have faith uh, once again are you appearing for examination net yeah ego uh, now one thing when it comes to relationships you need to surrender ego because ego is absolutely you know the biggest detriment for your relationships and the last one is invite baba into your heart and home and see the miraculous transformation of your life so basically baba i believe for a couple of you is actually your guru but you realize it yet or not is different but if you invite him in he will come and he will help you make your life into what it is supposed to be yeah but overall these are the messages that you need to receive when it comes to your life and as always as i wrap this up i'm going to be leaving you with my best wishes for your future i'll see you next time bye hello and if you've selected pile 2 these are the messages that you need to receive for the upcoming 10 days let's start with monology now for you pile 2 the messages it is time to release the negativity so if you're holding any kind of negative feelings towards somebody towards a situation or a goal please make sure you release that because at this point of time the only thing that is holding you back is your own negativity so please convert that into positivity so amazing things can happen to you pile two you have three of wands ace of swords seven of pentacles okay three of cups wow and you have knight of cups okay now in the upcoming 10 days for you a lot of new opportunities may show up in fact some of these opportunities are going to be opportunities that you are waiting for 
and let me tell you this you're very clear in your mind you know what to do and you know what the right thing for you to do is and you're acting accordingly sometime in the middle of the week you're also going to be feeling a little bit impatient like you want things to come to fruition right now but it is taking a little bit more time than it is supposed to but remember be patient today so that you can get the fruits of your labor tomorrow and it is happening quickly than you expected so maybe what is happening you know you are anticipating you're going to get a solution by this date and it is actually coming beforehand yeah so don't worry about things just hang in there is what i'm going to tell you now in the upcoming 10 days i also get a feeling like you may get an invitation to go out socially sometimes this could be from a crush that you were really hoping and praying will ask you out to somebody who really likes you of course can be a friend as well but it would do well for you to accept this invitation because accepting this invitation will bring you a greatest amount of happiness because i feel like you know the people who surround you right now especially a couple of you of them i really want you to be happy like your happiness is a concern for them and i feel like they are acting accordingly also is indicated good time with family good time with friends just relaxing and enjoying yourself you know we all deserve those times because when we are with people and people who we really love we get away from negativity and i get a feeling that is exactly what you need you need to get away from yourself in this week and just go out and have fun and that fun is actually waiting for you to find it now i feel like in the next 10 days people are going to be looking up for you you know they're going to be like observing you a great deal observing the way you work and the way you talk and the way you walk everything like you are some kind of inspiration for them that's what i'm seeing here but regardless if people are observing you you need to observe them as well and observe them carefully to understand them and understand their behavior because understanding people's pattern at this stage is very important for you especially in the upcoming 10 days to see how much you can predict their behavior just hang on to this message because i get a feeling you are going to be needing it at a later point of time now uh, when it comes to your health please make sure you're drinking enough water because sometimes you know in our busy schedules in our workplaces we forget to drink water can you imagine that and that may be happening so please if you want to feel free to pause the video drink water or drink tea coffee whatever you want to but preferably water if i may suggest because you know staying hydrated will help you a great deal and help your body a great deal because hydrotherapy helps in cleansing out any toxic energy from your body as well and maybe that needs to happen to a particular degree yeah hydration very important now one thing that you have to be careful of is your ego see what is happening you know people admire you in some ways people respect you in some ways by too but sometimes it kind of goes to your head and then you end up saying things that you possibly shouldn't or you end up behaving in a manner that isolates you from the rest of the people and that is happening for you in the next 10 days yeah so please be a little bit careful about not having pride about your life and about your accomplishments yeah be careful now uh, once again your beauty is something that is important to you so maybe in the upcoming 10 days you're also going to be going shopping maybe for new clothes to get a makeover or just to feel you know right by you those times so maybe you're dressing up for a good occasion either way it can happen but you know beauty your own beauty is going to be important for you and let me tell you people are noticing that about you you taking care of your appearance people are noticing that about you yeah people notice you a lot pile too i don't know why that is now please remember when it comes to everything moderation is necessary whether this is your diet whether this is you know everyday situation how much time you spend outside how much time you spend with people the amount of time you sleep wake up there has to be a balance to everything yeah because if you're burning the midnight lamp at your work at your studies in your relationship there has to be balance balance is the key for everything good in life remember that now i'm also going to be giving you messages for your relationships in the upcoming 10 days let's take a look okay 
uh, give thanks for the blessing of love too soon to come your way know that you deserve to be and have all that your heart truly desires so as i mentioned maybe somebody in your life already likes you and is observing you to a certain extent yeah may ask you out as well but somebody clearly clearly likes you and you have to give thanks for that because when you are grateful you attract the right kind of people in your life a playfulness laughter is the best therapy have some fun together and remember love is the greatest healer so please schedule time to be happy schedule time to be playful and to be away from your everyday responsibilities especially in your relationship so if you are already in a relationship try and go out for a fun day out or a good holiday that will help you yeah i'll also shuffle a couple of more okay a look inside yourself examine what is causing you to feel this way so when it comes to relationship if you feel a particular way about it ask yourself why you're face feeling that yeah because see we all understand our emotions we just pretend not to sometimes and friendship is most important in relationship so maybe you feel like you know you're being too much of a girlfriend boyfriend too much of you know spouses so the friendship element is very important so not just that bond of friendship in your relationship and it will dramatically improve friendship is everything that is what i personally believe in and also give you your tea leaf cards to see what extra messages are coming forth okay love once again love is highlighted yeah so spending time with people you love or that one person you love is going to be important in the upcoming 10 days a uh, news or birth of a child or new business opportunity for some it could be like you know a new baby is going to be born in your family or is already born in your family by the time you watch this or it can also be the start of a new business opportunity but you receiving some news that is for sure a romance celebration and party so definitely a party is on cards for you or just a get together at that if not a party a family wishes coming true especially you know if you find the love of your life and you decide to get married that can be one thing but even you know you doing something like you know creating a new business for yourself or the birth of a child brings happiness and waiting for news package or letter so if you're waiting for some kind of news it may be on its way already yeah and what's this a spiritual development enlightenment awareness and understanding now spiritually in the upcoming 10 days you're developing developing in a newer area is also coming through and your understanding about the nature of spiritual practices the nature of your soul is also going to be increasing and climbing towards success so as i mentioned you know when it comes to your work probably new opportunities will show up business opportunities as well but you're climbing towards it and you're climbing it remember you're not at the top yet yeah so be a little bit patient and that may be you know annoying you a little bit uh, one more do not back down from opposition show strength and fortitude so if somebody is not okay with your opinion stay strong on what you feel is right for you show strength and fortitude okay new opportunities are waiting for you as i mentioned at the beginning certain new doors open but you have to knock on certain doors yourself as well yeah remember this and i was not supposed to give you know messages from sign today but because pile one like literally had the most amazing thing happen and the most magical thing happen so baba is here for everyone uh, the power of udi once again water i'm getting the message of hydration here and water so if anybody is suffering from ill health or you feel like you know something is not right in your body udi will help you and so will water because of course both are super powerful okay health health be careful about your health okay in the upcoming 10 days because you have like three messages regarding that so once again a doing a japa of the name of baba can help you improve your health om sai natha nama is my favorite works all the time if you don't have your own a uh, miracles once again you may witness some miracle in the upcoming 10 days and one more Baba is not constrained by time or space he will come to your aid whenever you need him so if there's somebody who's thinking that baba is far away will he come to help me he will come to help you make no mistake just call on him that is all you need to do yeah? i will give you 
your letters and numbers i number 1 25 26 17 g r 31 e o 77 you you guru are you watching the minions this week <laughs> okay i you have 33 h t t again 23 r x a e f number 21 r u n i 29 uh, once again you tie tying up the loose ends like fixing something or if you're working on a project you know tying up the loose ends and submitting a file of particular you know kind that may be on the cards for you b you have v number 14 12 blank tile c and you have m now care so maybe you need to take care of yourself and especially when it comes to you you need to take care of your health yeah please be careful about that all right and take a break if you have to don't overwork especially for this week yeah anyway as i wrap this up i'm going to be leaving my best wishes for you take care of yourself rest when you have to and just have a great week i will see you next time bye Hello and if you've selected pile 3, these are the messages that you need to receive for the upcoming 10 days. From your moonology, okay, you have luck on your side. So probably anything you touch will turn to gold this time. So please make the most of the situation. You know, if you want to take a chance on something, this is your week. But luck is clearly on your side. Now, from your tarot, you have four of swords. You have the hermit temperance you have the moon and you have six of wands yes luck is clearly on your side because whatever you put your mind to it is working for you so some goals being realized this week is also possible now this is going to be a mixed week for you pile three where one part of the week is busy and the next part of the week is pretty chilled out you are very even-minded yourself you know you're not really going into extremes with anything you're not troubling yourself beyond a point you're playing it right by your energies sometime during the week you'll feel like isolating yourself you probably don't want to talk to people you just want to do something that you have fun with you don't want to things that are naturally more for you of course for students you may have to make extra effort towards studying this week and actually getting in depth into things people who are working on research paper work hard guys there is a lot more that you need to do yet yeah now emotionally sometime during the midweek you're going to be having ups and downs with your emotions where one time you feel like i think this is right for me and the second time you're like okay you know this is so wrong for me so massive emotional ups and downs is what i'm seeing but it is a phase eventually with rest and care you will get out of it okay also this week if you can get into meditation is very important and if you can just take some time out to connect with yourself to ground your energies and do what is right for you is going to be important also your spiritual life is highlighted more than normal because anything you set out to this week is going to be turning right in your favor so if you have some submissions to make if you have some kind of interviews in place or if you have something that you've been waiting for for a very long time this is a very good week for things to actually work in your favor now this week your bonds are strengthening first of all your bond with yourself is strengthening and second is the bond with somebody you care that is really really strengthening which is making you very happy 
yeah so family relationships i feel like will get better in the upcoming 10 days and also very likely you're going to be get, getting closer to one particular family member okay of course this can be your mom or somebody that you really connect with but you know strengthening bonds once again is highlighted for you or spending quality time with somebody you love and care about deeply is indicated now interestingly there is also some kind of initiation that is happening for you now this could be initiation into a particular spiritual order or getting the blessings from an ascended master that you truly believe in but spiritually massive growth is coming your way in the upcoming 10 days if you work at it and remember i'm telling you if you work at it and especially if you work at it consistently but some kind of initiation in a spiritual order is indicated for you in the next 10 days now also is important your well being yeah taking care of yourself taking care of your emotions taking care of your body and doing only those things that make you happy and ignoring everything else so please take care of your own well being than anything else now once again also is highlighted your communication and i feel like you're going to be communicating less and when you're communicating you're just communicating what you're supposed to you're not doing anything extra which is why it is making it so powerful but your communication is highlighted and it is making your bonds of relationship or friendship powerful now let's take a look at messages from your love life okay secret admirer okay this week somebody clearly has deeper emotions from you than they are letting on so somebody really likes you but they want to hide it from you for some reason yeah so you clearly have a secret admirer and you may not will uh, not always understand why certain things happen however there is always a higher purpose to events in your life through turmoil a blessing will soon be revealed so especially if you feel like you know something is not right right now the reason why things are not right is because it is going to turn into a blessing at a later point of time so just need to be careful a little bit and a little bit patient because i feel like with time the secret admirer will reveal there you know in a most desires to you deep in your heart you already know the answer do what feels right so especially when it comes to relationships you know you know what is right for you you also know what the right thing to do is at this particular time so whether you act it or not is your choice so it all comes down to you yeah and time you're trying too hard give it time so i'll tell you this when it comes to relationships too it is best you take some time off because i feel like there is a little bit of confusion when it comes to you in your own mind yeah so give it some time things will get better for you i will also give you messages from your tea leaf cards okay let's take a look a solid foundation success with effort so when it comes to your work you need to work on your foundation the very basic of what you're doing no matter what level you are in are your basics still as thorough as they used to be for my students have you mastered the basics if not you need to go back to that and put more effort so that you can succeed a uh, good luck okay saturn energy coming through but saturn is giving you good luck once again with the initiation part you know i feel like without saturn's presence this could not have happened because spiritual blessings the kind that saturn bestowed after having tested you is massive yeah massive and which is why maybe you are getting that through a spiritual master or a spiritual order a uh, beware of great pride the one thing that you have to be little careful of is your pride especially if you are achieving something yeah be careful of that and your intuition uh, use your intuition to make beneficial changes okay so this week it's about your intuition if you feel you need to do a particular thing please go ahead and do that and if your mind is telling you not the right thing to do stay away a uh, increase in material wealth or spiritual growth can be both but i see this more as spiritual for you in the upcoming 10 days a goal oriented person so if you want to hit a particular target like you have a goal in mind you need to work on steps that you need to take once again take care of the basics the foundations and become a goal oriented person no going with the flow for you 
news is on the way so some kind of news is going to find its way into your life hard work okay now honestly you need to work hard okay everything that will come to you whether it is luck whether it is success it'll come through your own hard work nothing for free a spiritual guidance so spiritually as i mentioned very important week but remember you're protected from harm so when it comes to doing any spiritual practice if you're worried about is this going to go right or is this going to backfire on me nothing is going to go backfiring on you you are just doing it right yeah you spiritually receiving the guidance and help that you're supposed to i'll give you messages from baba in his infinite compassion baba grants wishes pray to him so any particular wish you have pray to baba he will help you you are under baba's protection so once again protection from harm comes to you from baba or whichever ascended master that you believe in don't worry and baba can communicate with anyone anytime anywhere look for signs so if you're looking for some kind of signs from baba you have to just look at your life and you'll be like okay i can really see his hand there a spiritual teacher once again a meeting with a spiritual teacher this week may be important maybe you'll meet somebody attend a particular course or a program or you know i feel like a wish that you have that you've asked from a spiritual teacher or a mentor will be granted to you this week and then he will expect you to walk on a particular path exactly like initiation when a particular person is initiated like you really want to be initiated and it is happening then they expect that you follow the rules of the order yeah maybe that is standing out for you as well i will also give you your letters and numbers b u h 2099 c 33 blank tile x a blank tile again okay s number 17 t i 69 you have o m r you have a u 9 you have s r i t 11 you have f t a 27 a again and a again yeah but overall these are the messages that you need to receive for the upcoming 10 days and as always as i wrap this up i'm going to be leaving you with my best wishes for the upcoming 10 days and more i will see you next time bye